y'all, it's your girl Chelly May, and I'm back here, of course, with another video. I need to find something else to say because that to me is kind of annoying just saying that all the time. I don't know if y'all like to hear it, but it's kind of annoying for me to say. <laughs> but I am back, and this time, as you read, TikTok made me buy it. So this product went viral on TikTok probably a couple months ago. I know I feel like I'm late, but I also bought this a couple months ago, and I just have not used it yet. So here we go. <laughs> Um, so this is the Clinique first look at the Clinique. It's almost lipstick, so they don't consider it a lipstick, and it's the Black Honey, right? So this is, it's a bit smaller than I expected it to be for, like, how much it costs. This is about $20, and they get it, they get it. It is sold at Ulta. Not sure if it's at Sephora or anywhere else. Um, but I did have to order it online because the store was sold out and the lady was like, yeah, people keep calling for that. I was like, yeah, it's on TikTok. <laughs> when people start calling you for random stuff that they ain't never called you before before, it's because TikTok. So TikTok made me buy it. So as you can see, I literally have not even opened this thing. It's just been sitting on my bathroom counter because... I'm kind of weird. When I buy new things, I like to like sit on them like they're an egg and wait for them to hatch. <laughs> they don't hatch. I just wait for the newness just to wear off. Like this ain't special no more. It ain't new no more. But it still got all the tags on it. Judge me. Don't judge me. I don't care. It's just what I do and I try not to do it. But it still happens. Um, so right now I just have Vaseline on my lips. So I'm going to take... My Neutrogena Makeup Remover Wipes. And let me get this off so we can have a blank canvas. That's why I'm so close to the camera right now because usually I'm like back here talking, but not. <laughs> yeah, see what's popping with this, all right? I do have a little bit of lip liner on too from earlier. I get all of that off without messing up my foundation. All right. It's so weird doing this in a camera and not a mirror. But okay. Gotta let them dry a bit. I'm weird. I like I lick my lips a lot, so I'm trying not to lick them right now because I know it's gonna taste gross. But let's get this bad boy open. And I literally just put these press-ons on, so I'm trying not to have one pop off because that's what they do. They press on and pop right off. Um, the reason why I am wearing press-ons right now is because I'm trying to give my nails a break from all the dip and the acrylic. They're just so damaged and. I don't want to walk around with them looking crazy, so press on is the game right now. Ugh. Okay, that was way easier than I thought it was going to be with these press ons. And I haven't had long nails in like a month and a half, so let's see what this thing is looking like. Pulling it right out. <laughs> the unboxing of it all. All right. My lips are good to go. I think we pull. <laughs> there it is. Okay. So this is what this is looking like. Pretty. And of course I dropped the top because I'm clumsy. I'm going to go pick that up. We back. Okay. <laughs> Did y'all hear my knees crack? Okay. We getting old. We getting old. No, we ain't. We, gonna, we ain't going to say that. Because I still look like 17, 18. I still get 15, 16 too. But I'm 29, so mm, there's that. So here's the top that I dropped, and this is what we're looking like here. Nice, deep, purpley, cherryish, plum type color going on here. Get the twist up, let's go. I'm trying to like figure out a good... Ooh -wee. Okay. And according to TikTok and the top beauty influencers, cause I don't know much about this. I just be doing, doing whatever, whatever works. 
you're supposed to just coat and coat and coat until you achieve the color that you want. And it's supposed to work with any um, skin tone, but honestly, I didn't see any chocolate girls do it. I also didn't go looking for nobody, so there probably were some chocolate girls on here doing it. So let's take a look. Let me get a little bit better angle here. And I do, excuse looking all up in my nostrils. I'm gonna try not to, <laughs> try not to have y'all up in my nose, but here we go. Okay, it's like one. My lips feel really dry from taking that off. They're kind of cute. Okay, let's go. Second coat. Okay, okay. Third coat. It's really pretty pinky on me. I like it. I like pink shades on me. You can really tell, see the pigment on my bottom lip more because my bottom lip holds more pink in the middle than my upper lip. So let's do another one. That's three. One thing I do like about this is I like how it's very... it moves on my lips when I rub my lips together it's glidey I'm I don't know if y'all use that as a term but glidey I don't like uh lip glosses that like stick but I like ones that like glide easily because I instead of licking my lips when I have the gloss on I'll rub them together so that was what three or four three that was three so here we go with four Mm -hmm. I like it. Then we're gonna stick with the four because I don't really I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> and I don't need to put all this on. So this is cute. It's pretty. Okay, we're I'm just moving around trying to catch it in different angles with this light, but I like it. It is very kissable too. Let's do a kiss test on my wrist hand wrist. <laughs> all right. I can't really see much. I'm gonna step out so y'all can just see my hand or try to get it. Hmm. Still pretty pigmented, even though I just kissed my hand. Can't really see it that well. Trying to get that in the light. But overall, I recommend so far, since I done kissed the layer off, <laughs> let's put it back on. Okay, so this is cool. I like this. Let's see how much, what it looks like on here, just for kicks and giggles. Okay. Hmm. I don't know what that was supposed to do. We're just doing things. But yeah, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll show this. This can definitely be used in a regimen with some lip liner. This is like an everyday thing though. I wish I'm feeling because ain't nothing wrong with every day because we need things every day <laughs> every single one but yeah so that is it on the Clinique black honey uh <laughs> chapstick lip gloss it's not really very glossy maybe it's not really, you might you could call it a stick gloss um but yeah I like it so far it's not, it feels very moisturizing, which is top notch, top tier. I like it. 10 out of 10 so far. Would recommend. Bam, so go get it if you haven't already tried it because, you know, it's been a while. But, you know, <laughs> sometimes we just need a refresher on things. But, yeah, I do like this. I like the way it looks. It's very pink on me, which I like pink on myself. So, if you're not too into pink, not sure if, if it'll... Mm. I don't know, make you happy if you, if you, I can't think of anything clever. Ugh. So anyways, thank y'all for watching. I will have a link in the description to Altus because that's where I personally purchased it from. 
I'm sure you can find it on Amazon or probably Sephora as well. Or maybe Target. I don't know. Maybe like some other place. Well, yeah, there are Altos in Target now. So you might be able to get it from Target. So I'll put the Alta link in my bio though. Just because that's where I personally got it from. Like I said, pretty inexpensive. $20. It's actually a pretty good size for $20. So those are my personal thoughts. First impression because as you can see came right out the box no i ain't touch it so true first impression on how i felt about that remember to like subscribe share comment uh, if you haven't already subscribed thank you so much to everyone who has subscribed i see y'all i notice y'all i get so happy it makes my day when i have one new subscriber okay and we're up to uh, we're getting close to 140 right now so very happy very thankful for all of y'all i truly appreciate you and if you do comment um i do try to get back to them within the first 48 hours of me seeing them because i do get the email so you'll usually get a return re return a reply <laughs> quickly um and let me know what y'all want to see from me like I, I know i need to do like another fashion haul um and probably some more hair stuff too. I definitely want to get back into doing some hair stuff. Uh, I'll probably actually just shoot on how I achieved these curls real quick. So there's shields. I just lost them. Anyways, thank y'all so much for walking, walking, watching. I will <laughs> zip my lip for now. Um, see y'all next time. Remember, it's your girl Shelly Mae.